What's fun? Speaking English. Okay, let's do it. Are you ready? This is Easy English. Good morning, everyone. This is Easy English. Today is November second, Friday. 입니다저는김태현입니다 And I'm Alex. Oh. Bright and early on a Friday morning. Mm. And it's already Friday. I know, but this is the second day of November, but it, it's Friday. It's it's been a long week as yeah. always, and mm. sometimes I just wanna oh, just hit the hit the snooze button. Mm-hmm. The button on your phone. Yeah. Just five more minutes. Mm-hmm. So, just five more minutes. <laughs> 음. 5분만더자야지누르고5분만더자야지누르고 So how many times can you do that snooze button three times? Well, if you wake up early enough, you can yeah. hit the snooze button ten times. Oh, 그래요 My roommate did that oh. in college. <laughs> <웃음> 자이번주가예그래월하고11월이만나는그런주였는데벌써금요일이됐네요네자아이가안일어납니다엄마는또깨우십니다근데늦게일어나놓고엄마를탓하는거예요엄마오늘뭐가있었는데제가준비해야되는데더일찍깨우셨어야죠엄마 Why didn't you wake me up earlier? 이녀석이지금자기가늦게일어나놓고 Why didn't you wake me up earlier? 이렇게말하면돼요 Yeah, it sounds like he's blaming mom, mm-hmm. but it might be his fault. Mm-hmm. 아이의입장에서엄마나아빠에게늦게깨워주셨다고불평할때도이렇게쓸수있는거고 <웃음> 그리고이제부부사이에서도마찬가지 Why sure. didn't you wake me up earlier? Yeah, vacations we use that a lot. Oh, because we need to see the sunrise mm. or start early. Oh, uh. why didn't why didn't you wake me up earlier? We should go. Mm, I missed. We missed the sunrise. Yep. Hmm. 일주일못봤잖아이럴수도있어요다양한상황이있을수있겠죠 Why didn't you wake me up earlier? 입니다오늘은엄마하고민준자어떤이야기하는지잘들어보세요그리고영어로먼저생각해보시죠민준아일어나오늘학교에늦겠다엄마저피곤해요5분만더주세요근데오늘일찍가서장기자랑준비해야하잖아뭐라고요아완전히잊어버렸어요더일찍깨우지그러셨어요깨웠지이번이세번째로깨우는거야장기자랑에나가기위해머리할시간도없잖아요선생님께전화해서네가좀늦을거라고말씀드릴게 Oh, such an important day. Yeah. He's 일찍일어났어요 He's got a Minjun has to get up and uh, dance. Mm, Let's yeah. say dance. Mm-hmm. <laughs> dance. <웃음> 자오늘대화에서는조금긴문장이두가지뽑았습니다차근차근완성해볼게요친절한문장의완성 Complete sentences. 첫번째문장이거좀길어서힘드셨죠장기자랑에나가기위해서머리할시간도없잖아요이건데저이거할시간도없잖아요 I don't even have time. 시간이그냥없으면 I don't have time 인데시간도없어요니까 I don't even have time. 뭐할시간머리할시간 To fix my hair. 네여기까지요 I don't even have time to fix my hair. 여기까지하고요 To fix my hair. 장기자랑에나가기위해서그러면 For the show. 간단하죠이렇게전체문장이요 I don't even have time to fix my hair for the show. 이렇게하시면돼요 I don't even have time to fix my hair for the show. 두번째문장은선생님께전화해서네가좀늦을거라고말씀드릴게이건데요먼저내가선생님께전화드릴게 I'll call your teacher. 그죠네여기에서선생님께전화드릴게인데당연히아들상대방이선생님이니까 I'll call your teacher. 그리고말씀드릴게 And tell her. 네여기까지요 I'll call your teacher and tell her. 뭐라고말씀드릴게네가좀늦을거라고 I'll call your teacher and tell her you're running a bit late. 이렇게하시면돼요그러니까네가좀늦을거라고좀늦게갈거라고라는부분이 you're running a bit late 이겁니다자다시한번해보세요 I'll call your teacher and tell her you're running a bit late. 이렇게하시면됩니다자두문장다시한번해볼까요장기자랑에나가기위해서머리할시간도없잖아요 I don't even have time to fix my hair for the show. 선생님께전화해서네가좀늦을거라고말씀드릴게 
I'll call your teacher and tell her you're running a bit late. 이렇게 복습됐습니다. 자, 본문 대화 궁금하시죠? 영어로 들려드릴게요. Minjun, wake up! You're going to be late for school today. Mom, I'm tired. Just give me five more minutes. But you have to go early today to prepare for the talent show. What? I completely forgot. Why didn't you wake me up earlier? I did. This is the third time I tried to wake you up. I don't even have time to fix my hair for the show. I'll call your teacher and tell her you're running a bit late. Ah, uh, man. I hated being late mm. in the morning. Mm-hmm. Running fast yeah. and then being the last one in class. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 Ah. <laughs> Minjun, wake up, get up, get out of bed. Mm-hmm. But you can say, hurry up. Hurry up. Let's go. Mm-hmm. You're going to be late. You can use like, words like kaja, like come Good on. Show. Yeah. Come on, let's go, mm-hmm. hurry up. Mm-hmm. All those are good, mm-hmm. but the ones with waking, mm-hmm. wake up. Get up, mm-hmm. get out of bed. 네, 이거예요. 그러니까 그야말로 잠자는 아이를 깨울 때 일어나라, 깨라라고 하는 건 get up, wake up, get out of bed인데 이건 말고 빨리 학교 가야 되는 거니까 come on 할 수도 있는 거, let's go 음. 할 수도 있는 거고 time for breakfast 하셔도 되는 거고, <웃음> 그죠? 아침이니까. No time for breakfast. <웃음> okay, 늦게 일어났으니까 네, 아침은 생략하고. 그리고 이렇게 말씀하시는 거죠. 오늘 학교에 늦겠다 너, 지각이야. You're going to be late for school today. 네, 만약에 늘 아들이 늦는다, 늘 딸이 늦는다 하면 you're going to be late for school again mm-hmm. today. Yeah. Uh, I had a question. Mm-hmm. In Korea, when you're mad, are your sentences longer? For example, mm. you're going to be late for school today. Oh. I'm angry. Oh. Or, hurry, yeah. you're gonna. Mm. Be late for school. It's quicker, right? You're gonna. Oh, 느낌이 좀 다르네요. Of course. Oh. So you, when my dad is angry, mm-hmm. he says the full sentence. Ah. You are going to be late for school today. Mm. Angry나 mad나 둘다 화가 나는 건데 일단 나온 김에 angry는 그냥 화가 난 거고 mad는 조금 감정적으로 좀 심정적으로 화가 났을 때좀더 쓰기도 해요. 아무튼 mm-hmm. 네, angry이나 mad 한 상황에서 얘기할 때는 문장을 full sentence를 그대로 얘기한다는 게 지금 포인트거든요. 그러니까 그냥 화가 좀안난 상태면 you're going to be late for school today. Right, it's a little more natural 그쵸? to say you're going to be. Uh-huh. You're, you're going to be. 이렇게 자연스럽게 하실 텐데 화가 나셨다면 you're going to be late for school today. 도박도박도박도박. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Even longer you are mm-hmm. going to mm-hmm. be late. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 제가 무슨 얘기를 했는데 만약에 mm-hmm. 어, 뭐 so why 그러면 제가 지금 화가 좀 나가지고 그렇다고요. <웃음> <웃음> 우리말 할 때도 또박또박 하는 게 이게 조금 어 이게 또 무서운데 이럴 yeah. 수 있잖아요. 그런 말입니다. 네. You're going to be late for school today. 이게 조금 이제 엄마 아빠가 화가 나셨다. Mm-hmm. 이걸 전달할 수 있는 거고. 엄마 저 피곤해요. Mom. I'm tired. You said the same thing yesterday, last night. I'm still tired. Okay. 언제 안 피곤하니 너는? Mom, I'm tired. 5분만 더 주세요. 5분만 더 잘게요. Just give me 5 more minutes. Mm-hmm. 5분만 더 자겠다는 거죠? Just give me 5 more minutes. Or just give me. Mm, give me 라고도 하죠. Just mm. give me 5 more minutes. And yeah, when you're asking for time mm. or when you need more more time to do something mm-hmm. then you say give me blank minutes mm. or give me two hours mm-hmm. and I will send you my homework just give mm. me two hours and I will send you my homework 그쵸. 그 정도 시간이 더 필요하니까 이 시간을 주세요 할때 give me more, more minutes give me 무슨 hours 이렇게 하시면 돼요 mm-hmm. 너 오늘 장기자랑이 있어서 학교 일찍 가야 되잖아 but you have to go early today to prepare for the talent show 이렇게 so you have to wake up right now. You have to go early today, 뭐하러? To prepare for the talent show. Yeah. 네. 
So the talent show in America is the uh, what is it? Charang Chunky Chunky Charang Chunky Charang. 네네 Uh, so in America, it's often done on a special day inside a gymnasium. Mm-hmm. But in Korea, we did it outside on sports day. Well, it depends. It depends, right? Yeah. Ours mm-hmm. they built a stage. We did it inside or outside. They did a stage, um, but I think the cultural difference is Koreans do a lot of dancing mm. for theirs, and I loved it. Oh, At so what did school. you do for the talent show? I danced. When you're young. Are oh, you danced in Korea <laughs> with our students? <웃음> 중학교 선생님이셨잖아요. Yes. 그렇죠. 네, 원어민 선생님이셨어서 그때 춤을 추셨군요. 네. Mm-hmm. Can I see your video clip? I have it somewhere on my phone. Okay. <웃음> 보고 싶네요. 자, 민준의 아들이 얘기합니다. 뭐라고요, 엄마? What? Is it today? 완전히 잊어버렸어요. I completely forgot. 평소에 진짜 잊지 말아야 되는 건데 어머, 나 깜짝 나 완전히 잊어버렸어. 그럴 때 I completely forgot. Mm-hmm. Uh, we use this when we apologize or we're startled, shocked. Mm. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry. sorry. I, completely I completely forgot. forgot. Yeah. 네, 이렇게. 좀 일찍 깨우지 그러셨어요, 엄마. Why didn't you wake me up earlier? Mm-hmm. Why didn't you wake me up earlier? Wake me up earlier. 일찍 깨우셨죠, 엄마. 깨웠지. Mm. I did. Mm-hmm. I did. 이게 지금 세 번째다. 너 깨우는 게. This is the third time I tried to wake you up. Mm-hmm. 내가 지금 몇 번째로 너 깨우는 중이다 이거예요. Yeah. This is the second time. This is the third time mm-hmm. I tried to wake you up. 이게 try to를 쓴 이유는 깨웠는데 아직 안 일어나고 지금 침대에서 지금 민기적거리고 있는 거잖아요. Mm-hmm. 그러니까 this is the third time I tried to wake you up. Yes, and in conversation, you can also say get, G-E-T, mm. to get you up. Mm-hmm. I tried to get you up. Get you up, 마찬가지. 왜냐면 일어나는 게 get up도 되고 wake up도 mm. 되니까. 네. Get you up, wake you up. You can say get you out of bed. Mm. Get you out of bed. Yeah. 그렇죠, 이것도 되네요. 어, 엄마 오늘 장기자랑 나가기 위해서 머리 할 시간도 없잖아요. I don't even have time to fix my hair for the show. Mm-hmm. So he keeps complaining. Yeah, but the fix here is yeah. important. Mm-hmm. Uh, you fix your hair when it's messy, mm. you're sleeping, and it's kind of... 머리 되고, yeah. 막 머리 뒤집어져 있고. That's to fix your hair. 그렇죠. Yeah. 그 머리를 정돈하는 거죠. 우리가 fix는 보통 yeah. 고장된 텔레비전 mm-hmm. 고치고 뭐 고치는 게 fix repair인데 yeah. 머리는 정리정돈하는 yeah. 거죠. If you're just... Putting wax in your hair. Mm-hmm. Do my hair. D-O. Do my hair. Just do my hair. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna do my hair. Mm-hmm. 나 머리 좀 할게. 이러면 do my hair. Yeah. 근데 머리가 자고 일어나서 엉망진창 뒤집어져서 이러면 fix my hair. Mm-hmm. 네 이렇게 쓰시면 돼요. 엄마가 이렇게 얘기하십니다. 참 엄마가 정말 well, she's a good mother. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 선생님께 엄마가 전화드려서 네가 좀 늦을 거라고 말씀드릴게. I'll call your teacher and tell her you're running a bit late. 네. That's it. Yeah. Just be late. <laughs> so you're running a bit late. You're late. To okay. run late mm-hmm. is a phrase that just means you are late. Mm-hmm. To run late is the verb form of that. 그렇습니다. 이게 동사 구호처럼 쓰는 건데 그러니까 run이 여기서 달리다가 아니라 빨리 달려갈 기호가 아니라 약간 늦을 겁니다. 그래서 mm-hmm. 늦는다는 게 you are late 혹은 you are running late. 두 가지 다 늦는다는 거예요. Yeah. I'll call your teacher and tell her you're running a bit late. Mm-hmm. 우리 말하고 다른 건 우리 말은 선생님께 전화 드려서 이렇게 할게라고 할 때는 남자 선생님인지 여자 선생님인지 몰라요. Mm. 근데 이걸 보면 tell her니까 아 선생님이 여자 선생님이시구나. Correct. 라는 게 보이는 게또 영화의 특징이기도 한데 <웃음> 다시 한번 들려드릴게요. Minjun, wake up! You're going to be late for school today. Mom, I'm tired. Just give me five more minutes. But you have to go early today to prepare for the talent show. What? I completely forgot. Why didn't you wake me up earlier? I did. This is the third time I tried to wake you up. I don't even have time to fix my hair for the show. I'll call your teacher and tell her you're running a bit late. Pattern and Sentences 첫 번째 패턴은 너 뭐뭐 하겠다. You're going to. 동사 원형만 넣어주시면 됩니다. 너 오늘 학교에 늦겠다 이러다가. You're going to be late for school today. 이렇게 하시면 돼요. You're going to be late for school today. 이렇게 하다가 비행기 놓치겠어. 
You're going to miss the flight. Miss. 놓치는 거죠. You're going to miss the flight. 네. 또뭐 하겠어? You're going to be tired tomorrow. 내일 피곤하겠는데 일찍 자는 게 좋지 않을까? 뭐 이렇게도 되고. If you put them there, you're going to lose your keys. 음, 거기다가 열쇠 놨다가는 나중에 잃어버릴 것 같다고요. 깜빡하고. 네, 이렇게도 되고. 자, 두 번째 패턴은 이렇게 하지 그랬어. Why didn't you? 동사 원형 넣어 주세요. 더 일찍 깨우지 그러셨어요. Why didn't you wake me up earlier? 이렇게. 네가 늦을 거라고 나한테 좀 알려 주지 그랬어. Why didn't you let me know you'd be late? Mm-hmm. 이렇게 될수 있겠죠. 그죠? Why didn't you let me know you would be late? 줄여서 you'd be late. 또는요? Why didn't you call me after dinner? Mm, 저녁 먹고 나서 전화하지 그랬어. 이렇게 다양하게 만들어 보시기 바랍니다. 이제 본문 대화랑 상관 있는 거 유용한 표현 하나 알려 드릴게요. <목소리> Useful sentence. Oh man, why are you late today? Oh, I'm sorry. We have a radio show. Oh, so, 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 sorry, 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 sorry. Oh, hurry Alex, up and Alex, 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 oh, why sorry, are you sorry. Late? Oh, 죄송해, 죄송해. Oh, 늦잠을 잤어요. Um, slept. You slept too much. Slept too much. Well, slept too. You can say that if you want. I didn't wake up. Or just say. <laughs> I overslept. 아, 이러면 되네요. over를 붙여주면 그 뒤에 오는 동사의 행동을 과하게 하는 거예요. 넘치게 하는 거예요. 원래 해야 되는 것보다. 그래서 I overslept. 늦잠을 잤어요. Yeah. I'm but, so sorry. But actually, mm. your first phrase was okay too. I slept too much. Yeah. <웃음> 좀 틀린 걸 만들어내야 되는데 가끔은 맞는 게 나오기도 하고 막 이래요. 네. 자, 늦잠을 잤어요. 좀더 효율적으로 알려드릴 수 있게 연구를 좀더 많이 할게요. 네, I overslept. 늦잠 잤어요. 이 표현 알아두시면 좋겠네요. 자, 본문 대화 다시 한번 들려드릴게요. Min Jun, wake up. You're going to be late for school today. Mom, I'm tired. Just give me five more minutes. But you have to go early today to prepare for the talent show. What? I completely forgot. Why didn't you wake me up earlier? I did. This is the third time I tried to wake you up. I don't even have time to fix my hair for the show. I'll call your teacher and tell her you're running a bit late. 자, 오늘도 세 줄의 일기장 중에서 한 문장 완성해 봅니다. 이번 문장인데요. 오늘 장기자랑이 있다는 걸 완전히 잊고 있었다. 내가 I completely forgot that I had a talent show today. 이렇게 다시 한 번요. I completely forgot that I had a talent show today. 이렇게 나머지도 만들어 보시기 바랍니다. EBS 랑에서 온라인 무료 수강권, Language Monster에서 A형의 영어 회화, 취업과 승진을 위한 영어 말하기 평가, 오픽 응식권을 드립니다. 네, 내일도 저희 만나주세요. 태연과 Alex의 Easy English. English.